Hello, today I'm going to show you how to create this outline text effect. Let's open a new document, select the type tool and type your text. Now click on the selection tool to make sure everything is selected and let's recenter it on the page. Open the align window, make sure align to artboard is checked and choose horizontal and vertical align center. Next we'll create outlines. Before we can do any changes to our text, we need to expand it. With the text still selected, right click with your mouse and choose create outlines. Then right click again and choose ungroup. This will allow you to move and make changes to individual letters. Bear in mind that your text won't be editable anymore. Next we'll round some of the corners. First switch to the selection tool and select the anchor point of a corner that you wish to round. Then click on the white circle, hold and drag to round the corner. And do the same with any corners you wish to adjust. Now we are ready to create an outline effect. Press the Ctrl and A keys on your keyboard to select everything. Then go to Object, Path and select Offset Path. Select the preview box to see what we are doing and change the offset to a higher number. You will notice that Illustrator created three new layers. With those three layers still selected, press the Ctrl and G keys on your keyboard to group them together. Click on this group, hold and move it to the bottom. Now apply a different color to it. Select all the other layers and group them together as well. Next we'll apply a gradient to the outlines. Let's select the top group layer to prevent it from shifting and make sure the bottom group is selected. Next we need to unite all the orange shapes together. First open the Pathfinder window. If you can't see it go to Window and select Pathfinder. Now choose Unite. You can leave it as it is or you can delete all the white empty spaces. Either use the direct selection tool, then click on the path and press the delete key on your keyboard a few times. Let's undo it. Or select the group selection tool, click on the path and press delete. This will get rid of all the anchor points at once. And do the same with any empty spaces you wish to delete. Finally, with the bottom group layer still selected, open the gradient window and apply any gradient you wish or create your own. If you like, you can select the dark letters and change their color as well. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.